from Soweto Marsh, from the township to the Johannesburg CBD, to the headquarters of the ANC, the governing party saying that they've been waiting for houses for decades and that the entire process has been riddled by corruption. They say they're fed up and they will not be participating in the election until someone gives them the keys to their homes. Snubbing the 2021 poll. Frustrated residents refusing to make the remark. And rejecting participation in the polls which they say is based on lies. Chrisada, Bapa comrade. Nkalub voter. Magan Piskiasa. Man voter and Piskiasa. If we don't vote the arm, no, 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 I mean, I'm not to vote. She says anyone who wants her vote must hand her keys to a house. She asks, where will she sleep after voting? She says she doesn't care whether the house doesn't have windows or doors. She wants her house. She says she doesn't care even if it's on a mountain. Amanda. The community says it's been a protracted wait for over 20 years for roofs over their heads. They demanded an audience with the city mayor or the Gauteng premier, but a member of the ANC's regional executive committee was deployed. Demand for a commitment to deliver the service sites and RTP house for Soweto backyard dwellers within 30 days. We need to be efficient in dealing with the issues of our people. Those pledges were made public for everybody to see. Now what we want to do, with your permission once more, is that if you give us the memorandum, we will then commit that with the agency that your matter needs to be attended to, at least within two weeks. So residents say if their demands are not met within that two weeks, they'll have to decide on a way forward, and that will not exclude protest action. Moments after signing, a change of heart. They said they would return to Soweto to cast their vote, but not before they wanted to march to the doorstep of Lutuli House. But now we are marching. Yes. Then it means we are contravening the gathering act. We're also aware that the protest is being led by a member, a councillor, a ward councillor from an opposition party, which is fine. It's fair enough. Nothing is lost in an in a election. Uh, some people treat it like a war. But what we've done is when we were alerted about the people outside the Tuli House, we contacted uh, Premier Makura and we spoke to the MEC Maile as well as uh, the, I think they've been in touch with the National Housing Minister to resolve this problem. En route to Soweto, remnants of the previous day's frustrations in the township. And as the sun set, long queues, over 6.1 million registered voters in Gauteng, accounting for the highest number in the country. Now that the polls have closed, political parties will be on edge ahead of Thursday's results announcement. Chris Alda Lewis, SABC News in Johannesburg.